Hey beauties, it's Viviana and today we're going to do a style that I have not done since my relaxer days. So this style in my head is called a satin braid out and once upon a time this was my staple hairstyle and I mean like every single week this is the hairstyle I would do. I had basically forgotten about this style but then someone had commented on one of my really really old videos my sock curl videos and was asking me to recreate that style so i haven't really worked out the logistics on how to do sock curls on my now natural hair but that did remind me of another hairstyle i used to do with unconventional fabric in my hair to create curls so how does this style differ from a regular braid out well when i was relaxed this was practically the only style I could do to really curl the ends of my hair when it was relaxed. So unlike a regular braid out that gave your hair a very flimsy straight look at the ends, the satin braid out actually gave your hair a little crinkle at the end so the curls at the end wasn't such a stark difference to the curls at the root of your head. I hope that makes sense to y'all. Okay. It was just a preference. I just preferred the look of a satin braid out, all right? So my hair is pretty much dry right now and I'm ready to take out these braids and see how this style looks on my now natural hair. But before, let me show you guys how I install these satin braids. You don't know. Bad man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This body baby, oh. Ah, this body baby, oh. Yeah, yeah, it's a bad man thing, yeah, yeah. Bad girl make you want to be based, nah, nah. Give me that thing where I go feel it late, nah, nah. The way you back it up, the way you boss in the place, nah, nah, nah. Oh, yeah. Very on time, yeah, don't be late, nah, nah. Said I'm in love with you, and I'ma give you anything you want. And I'm going to give you everything you need man Put a little extra mousse at the ends And continue plaiting I'm just going to make a knot at the end okay. oh, I'm very interested to see how this is going to turn out Tell me love Tell me what you want to know I go give you all and more Bad man I feel your flow Why I'm slow This one no be private show Your friends they tell you Say I beat nobody Been searching all around But I found nobody Call on me, call on me I go give you all of me, all of me Baby make you follow me, follow me I go give you all of me, all of me A motto Sean say she moving to the baseline the way she a wine make a man wanna praise the wine She a gypsy girl, she a fine like a sunrise The way she move make a man cry I'm feeling her, feeling her so I want in, I want in, I want in I remember always putting one plait right here in the middle So that it can cover up my party Wine I'm slow, this one will be private show Tell me love, tell me what you want to know I go give you all and more Bad man I feel your flow Why I'm slow This one no be private show You don't know So all my satin ribbons that I had previously cut are now finished So lucky you You're going to see me destroy a do-rag for this style Alright so it came out of the package like this It's a regular old do-rag Right and it's of course a satiny material so you see this long part of the do-rag that you would use to tie around your head? I'm just going to cut from here, go straight up. Ow! So now I have two long pieces of satin ribbons and a part of a do-rag I really don't have any use for. At least not right now. So with these two ribbons, you see how thick they are? Oh, they're connected. Oops. Yeah, 
let's let's um disconnect these two so just cut that okay and now it's two two separate pieces and then you see how thick it is yeah I'm just gonna cut each of these in half easy so just So from that one do rag, I now have one, two, three, four pieces of satin ribbons. And no need to cry about the do rag, guys. Come on, do rags are cheap. And now I have four pieces of ribbon that I can reuse over and over and over again. Just think of it as repurposing the do rag. and I don't have any more do-rag that I want to destroy so with this worthless part of my do-rag I'm going to try and get one more strip from it so I'm going to cut from one end of the do-rag and go all the way around to the next end and of course keeping that middle section connected so for the best okay all right so I'm gonna go sit under the dryer for a few hours and allow my hair to dry and yeah we'll see how this looks in the morning man this look is really nostalgic oh wow <laughs> now we're back at this point where my hair is dried so I sat under the dryer for about you see, if I really tell you how long I sat on the dryer, I'm gonna be like, oh my god, how you sit on the dryer for so long? I want to ensure that my hair is completely dried, okay? So yes, I sat on the dryer for three and a half hours. Let me finally see if I like the look of my now natural hair. Come let me go. Whoa. Come let me go. Strategically added this one right at the center 
because we have this big old part in the middle. like an entire week but I think for that to happen on my natural hair I should have done the braids a lot smaller which means I would have needed more satin ribbons I mean I definitely will be doing this style again very easy to do some nice chunky braids with my satin ribbon and yeah it gives me a nice fluffy look but this is nice this is definitely nice you don't think it was a wig or something, don't it? Okay, beauties, I hope you enjoyed that tutorial. If this is the first time you've ever heard of this style, let me know down in the comment section if you've already heard of this style, if you've ever tried it, if you have not tried it, if you're not curious to try it, let me know down in the comment section and do uh, it. If you're new to my channel and you haven't decided that after watching this entire video, you want to subscribe, not to worry. I'll leave some more of my videos up in the icons so you can check them out, get more familiar with my channel, and hopefully by the second or third video, you'll have decided to subscribe. I'm trying to get to a million subscribers by the end of the year, so yeah, come on. There probably some people on your social media that might actually like my content. Um, so if you like my content, share it and tag some friends and uh, yeah. Okay, beauties, thanks again for watching. Later! Mwah. Did I mention I'm late? Yeah, I'm late. Alright, so let's pull off this tie head and see what we're working with and just accessorize. Before I start experimenting with any growth aids, let me find out my natural growth rate first. Firstly. Yeah, firstly. <laughs>